Hello, my little thing, family and friends. Welcome back to the happy place. And y'all, I walk right into some new Christmas goodies. They got the Christmas dishes back out. Look, this pretty, pretty is back. The gorgeous trees are back. Oh, I love this. I don't think I ran into this too much last year when it came out. Not the mugs. But let's get into this location, y'all. Look at this. Yeah, I remember these as well. The most wonderful time of the year. That joy. Happy holidays. Yes, and look at the holly plates. Now, this is the holly plates, but I wonder if they got this beautiful hunter green. That's what I don't remember running into. So, I do see this with the pretty happy holidays. Let's see on the other side, y'all. Let's see if they got the green. They do have the placemats. I love how... Like they have the placemats to match. I thought I saw, yeah, this is just the all white and the holly. And there is also, see, they even got the beautiful tree towel. Oh, I love this green. I think it's the green, y'all, that's getting me. Yes, I think it's the green. Oh, no, guys. So on this side, it's all fall. It's so pretty, though, right? So the pumpkin set is on this side gorgeous and then right when we walk in the door they got the day of the dead cups and some black and white i love how they color coordinated that really nice but yeah so no forest uh plates just yet we got one of the workers putting up some of the things out right now on the christmas wall but look now did i see this building i know i was looking at all the buildings let me see if i can see the front of this cobblestone bed and breakfast no i don't remember this building no this is another box so this is the bed and breakfast building and what is this <gasps> with a christmas tree hot cocoa oh my gosh they're gonna make me want these they're making me want the whole little village yeah this is a whole other set this is the box i ran into i love this house so there's a house and a church in this set the house the church and i feel like it's one more that was in this set it was four but it was not these two so let me let me look down here y'all looks like the same ones but yeah i don't remember the bed and breakfast girl okay we did see these the car the camper but they are outdoing themselves with these new houses girl and they do like up girl look at the christmas tree i can't get over it so cute and then they do have the miniatures out look at the gate how pretty real those look got the bottle brush trees and the selected colors oh and these winter village a light up too girl so many things that light up here at dollar tree now wow oh they also have the gate in brown Look at that with little accents of snow on it. That is adorable. And we got our some Christmas socks here on the end cap. Look at Frosty and Elf, y'all. Elf for a buck twenty-five. Yes, ma'am. That is adorable, especially if you do like the PJs. You want to match? Is this the Polar Express? Yep, got the Polar Express here okay guys this is cute and new these are like mini stockings with mickey they're disney we got mini nightmare before christmas like i wonder if they're using these you can use this to put like a card a uh, gift card in it they are so mini and cute frozen this is new i have not seen this in any of the stores yet and paw patrol girl i wonder if i can get one off so i can show you guys in comparison to like a regular look at that a regular stocking you see how little it is that is adorable yeah i would definitely put gift cards in these some candies maybe gift card boom quick gift cute add-on to a gift if you like then here right in front of me the regular size stockings loving these I really like this red and white it's like a uh, Christmas sweater and then I turned around and they have the monogrammed ones so I'm seeing a and K's a and K uh, there's that s 
S. We got a B here. So they even have these and the red and white. Oh, and some more of the little mini stockings on the side. And girl, like I said, there is a stocker down here. One of the workers stocking ornaments. But here we go again with this. I saw this in another one, but this is blue. I keep wondering if it lights up. It probably doesn't, but that middle, I feel like it's just so sparkly. It looks like it lights up. These are the ones I'm used to, like the little flat ones. How many are in here? Ten. You get ten in here. A little snowflake. You can hang up, put on a wall. You can make a little wallscape with it. This is cute. This is huge. Like, that's a big snowflake. Yeah, just kind of taking a look at the ornaments. What is this? Are these like the Christmas lights? Girl, it's a pick. Wait, let me see if I can get one out. So you get three on the pick. How adorable is that? Nice. And I see one here in red. And then we got some beautiful picks. Beautiful. But be careful of the glitter fallout. But I'm seeing some fuchsia, some red, white, gold. You could definitely, definitely kind of blink out or make a beautiful floral uh, piece for your tables, entryways. They got it all. Yeah, they're definitely trying to get Christmas and most of the spaces. Now, this aisle has Christmas hats. We did see some of the character hats. Look, I don't know if they, did they always have Stitch? Oh my goodness, DTDT. Barbie, Peppa Pig, Snoopy, which is like so classic, and you know Mickey is classic. Nice. Yeah, they you can tell they just got started kind of doing this one. It's looking really nice and neat. And there is my skirt. I love that skirt. But yeah, they just start putting these things out here at this location. And girl, here we go. So this is like the, I want to say a third or fourth <laughs> side of Christmas. I do believe, though, when I came here last, this was here. Um, this was like kind of the only Christmas they had opened up. So now they have expanded and got it going on their like big wall as soon as you come in. It's getting up. It's getting up now, y'all. These are cute. We've seen these before, but this one... I do not remember that red and gold. I don't remember that one. I do remember this. I've ha I have some of these. What color is this? I can't tell if it's like a rose gold or a pale pink. Okay, guys. In the aisle of toys and girl. It's a lot of things, but I know we're probably going to be seeing even more toys as the season um, progresses y'all look i remember when i was on the hunt for that i did finally find it girl they even got more over here yes on the updated little mermaid it's a lot going on over here um but they all do look familiar but it is quite stocked look look at all the characters girl like these are so cool to collect um maybe add on top of a cake look at that the princesses pixar i still do not know the name of this line of these like i feel like more modern or updated kind of barbies like of all different women shapes sizes colors i love it um i'm sure there's a name for that collection and then my cute little boba stuffies are here yeah we have seen these I feel like I didn't see this one. Now, is this Skipper or Barbie? Did we see that one? With the cute little dress? I don't know if I saw that one. I know we did see, like, yeah, I remember this one, this one, this one. Look how they have them holding their hand. Um, yeah, this one. I definitely remember that one. But I don't know the name of that particular collection. It's really nice, though absolutely love these <laughs> these come in handy for the littles if they want to help you uh clean up yes yes they got it in blue and pink and we still got a lot of these little beanie baby like little i want to call it a tag along you can tag it on the back of a backpack or a purse um but we still got a lot of these 
I don't know if they're restocked or if they just haven't really sold. But I feel like they're restocked because the first time I saw them, they were flying off the shelves. So, they definitely are a restock. Some pretend play items here for the littles. Alrighty, guys. I made it over near the books. Y'all know I love to stop at the books. Art journal. Your archetypes. What? Mixed media techniques for finding yourself now you know I want to see what that's about if I can okay what archetype what are archetypes because that's definitely my question <laughs> what else we got oh look this is cool like if you're into this again y'all trying to work with one hand <laughs> this is a cool book for a buck 25 it, it's even showing you like how to draw draw the nose draw the lips the little guidelines that's so cool i've never seen that okay it's a couple books here guys um let's see oh i remember finding this and i absolutely love it love the fur you're in the monster wit and wisdom from sesame street it is a fave y'all this is so cute i love it um looks like some more books that we got in here looks like a lot of them we may have seen i don't see anything new girl what is this oh they always come out with these astrology books yeah and i would see my sign <laughs> that is so funny i feel like it hasn't always been um this color i feel like when i have seen these books they've always been like black because look on the seat they must have a couple or they just changed the color because we got capricorn wait if i can pull it apart i see capricorn i see leo they're in these pretty colors and then the cancel one i found so they just probably changed the color of it this is for 2025 so it's the updated ones i guess what is this the atkins 100 eating solution yeah they just changed the color here's a sagittarius i see a, a gemini up there so those are new this is pretty waiting for the night song Dawson has written a novel of elegant contradiction intimately explored beautifully woven together nice and then y'all remember this guided journal your girl did pick that up she sure did um it's nice to see that again what is this in front of me y'all what Masson wait Mason Mooney doppelganger detective so this like a it says flying eye books again trying to work with one hand guys let's see it looks so different i love the colors it's a kids book looks like maybe a tween or right right before those teen years yeah oh it's you again back to check on, on mason mooney are you <laughs> oh that's cute yeah I'm, I'm thinking more like nine ten year olds would like this i've never seen this before but it looks quite interesting um and what is this under here oh okay so the ready to read books pj mask we seen this the drunk <laughs> uh recipe book what is this so yeah i think we have seen these your girl is not about to go through all of these books um uh, is that again again i'm trying to see what this one is because i feel like this one is different I thought this was that, but oh, this is cute. Dynamite Kids Cooking School. Look at that. Isn't that nice? Girl, now I gotta see if I can look through it. Delicious recipes that teach all the skills that you need. And that what she is picking up, girl, looking good. Let's see what we got here. Oh, it looks like some kind of wontons pan fried dumplings girl y'all know i am about to cook books this thing is quite heavy too look how thick i wonder if we can see how much nope it's covered let me put that in the car for maybe i love a good cookbook <laughs> i love the cookbook so that is a newbie find and it looks like we got a couple here i thought this was the other cookbook that we found girl and what is that wait a minute wait a minute michelle fun makeup your life guide to beauty style and success online and off you better stop this is cute as well 
I love, love, love treasuring over here or trudging over to the books. And this looks like something else, but girl, it's so up under here. Let me see if I can get to it. Okay, guys, I was able to pull one out in its adult coloring book, Butterflies. So cute. Yes, 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 y'all. So that's what we got so far in the books. There may be more, but like I said, I don't think I'm going to keep going through this because I don't want anything falling on me. But a couple new finds, couple new finds. They got a couple art pieces in here too, which I don't think belong. I really don't, but <laughs> beautiful zebra. All right, guys, moving on to the next one. We're going to see and see. Look how neat the puzzles. The puzzle books get to stay quite neat. I love that. I wish the regular books could, but uh, very hard to keep them. But th look at this. Gorgeousness. Okay. I can see right in front of me. I can pick what I want <laughs> and I don't have to go through the struggle. Right next to the books, some arts and crafts. I see the they left the yarn in the box here um some of my locations actually put the yarn like up in like a wire stand and girl what is this it's all the stickers down here hopefully they have them hanging up because i don't think anyone wants to kind of have to go through a whole box but if you got the patience and the time please feel free some more yarn i see some of the faux fur also the craft squares and all the different prints these are cute. The stickers. Oh, I forgot, y'all. We gotta. We want to decorate our pumpkins this week, so also kind of looking for some kind of craft and things to kind of help with that too. Cause yes, y'all, it is Halloween week, but we like we always like to paint our pumpkins or decorate our pumpkins every year. Um, it's just something we love to do as a family. So your girl gotta find something we know what we like to do but i'm just double checking the arts and crafts to see if there's something we can kind of add to it so here we are in crafter square i'm seeing a lot of things we've seen i might need to pick up some brushes though to paint the pumpkin hmm this cute look how thick that is oh here it is right here nice I don't believe they're new though I feel like I've seen them but isn't that cute cute DIY or I kind of like it the way it is all right next aisle guy phone accessories I hate that they don't sell the flat back anymore they got a lot of these but I really love the flat ones that they came out with they're just so much easier to work with to put in your pocket <laughs> and I have been searching my Dollar Trees, guys. They don't carry them anymore. The little adhesives to the back of the phone that are flat, and it's just like a ring that you pop out. It's really nice. Oh, the little one <laughs> right near me. Some parents just walked by. Cutie pie, too. The color changer. We've seen these the via uh, LED. We've seen these before. It's just so stocked, so it looks like something is new. <laughs> it's just well stocked, y'all. They're doing a great job here. I love this location. Some of the things in automotive and hardware. This is something I don't think I've seen before. Refresh your car odor eliminator. Yeah, I don't remember that. What does it say? Up to 90 hours. Okay, a freshness. Cute. I just like how it's made. Okay, here is some fur baby things, just some foods and snacks. We got some training pads down there. So if you got a new puppy at home and you're trying to train them, grab some of those pads from the DT. Bang, best bang for your buck. When uh, my daughter had her dog over, we kept those in the house. Because <laughs> the doggy, uh, poor thing, did not want to go out. What is this? Sweet potato chicken wraps. Ooh, by Butcher Bar. Duck, duck, jerky. Triple flavor kebabs. Well, come on. Chicken jerky. Nice. I don't think I've ever seen these little treats. I don't often look at them, but I know I have not seen that or this one. What is this? The first ingredient in this is chicken. They're bare bones. And then, girl, look at this. Come on, get gourmet. Beef and cheese flavor. 
by Kind Rewards. There's also some chicken dental chews for your fur babies. Girl, I feel like I've not seen hardly any of these. And what? Piggy ears. Oh no. Piggy ears. Plant-based. Well, come on. It's a plant-based chew for your dogs. I've definitely never seen that. Delicious chew for your dogs that they will love. Okay. Yeah, that's new. A lot of new uh, snacks here. Now, this one is a pig ear. It doesn't say plant-based, so it's probably definitely a real pig ear snack. I've not seen that either. Girl, wait a minute. Water buffalo? Truffle? Wait, that's a toughie. I'm sorry, girl, because look, I told you, they got gourmet over here with these snacks. About 90% of them I've not seen. Ooh, I'm seeing some new toys. Look. I feel like it's been a minute since we've had toys. Girl, why do I want this to decorate with? <laughs> I think I want this just to so my my daughter loves Reese's. Loves them. I've never seen that. That's cute. That that might have to go for decor. But look at this one. We got twins. Girl, and look. Right in front of me. I want to decorate something so bad with this. Like, I just want to do with Halloween coming up. This would be so cute as like a decor piece like you know a bowl of candies <laughs> oh my gosh how cute wait i see the squeaky oh girl this thing hard i need a little doggy to chew that okay so where's the look i'm trying to put this one back because i don't want to hide the, the hershey and i don't want to hide the reese but i don't know where twizzler is so we're gonna put it up here nice these are new oh they're back there they're behind the hershey's okay got it those are cute so cute see i'm used to these here they got these in here the puffy ones sounds like a bag we got the little pops still got that got the bark chips but girl yes on the new hard toys like girl the ropes which we did see with the ball because we know some of our fur babies can be real rough with their toys okay guys we're over here in the socks and i don't see anything new this store is pretty good with the socks um i feel like because they still have a lot of the um socks they had they probably haven't put um, any more out except for like christmas socks which are over near christmas items but yeah i'm not seeing anything new we've seen these like the barbie the et yeah we've had these i even had i've picked up most of these what is this Okay, Looney Tune, Taz, and uh, Marvel. Yeah, I feel like we've seen all of these. I'm not seeing anything like striking me new. The villains. Yeah, nothing new over here. But you know, we always got to check. I see my girl. Alrighty, guys. Your girl is going to stop this here and we're going to have a part two because we still got a lot more things to see and I don't want to take up too much of your time. So check out part two. Let's find out what we got in our beauty and our foods and all of that in part two. Thank you so much for coming along for a part one of a great Dollar Tree walkthrough. Catch you in part two.